Alrighty, everybody, welcome back to War Thunder. Now, I have so graciously been given by that guy, great guy Jubals, a Calliope for one whole hour. Uh, I've never played this tank before, so I figure we'll try it out. Um, I'm not really sure what crew I want. Let's see here 4.3. Uh, it's a 4.3, right? Yeah, 4.3. Not really sure what is at that tier to be honest. Um, M4A2, that crew over here. Alright. 4.3. Oh, I got the Calliope. That's about it. So let's choose a crew here. Yep. Let's see if there's anything lower than that. We can throw on there, and we got 4.0. On oh, the M24 Chaffee. Let's actually throw on the M10, I think that's a solid choice. And the planes, 4.3, there's a couple choices. We got the P51 already on there, apparently. P47. Choose this one. Yeah, I think I've got a decent number of stuff for this particular one. No, I don't. The D25 that I've got all the shit for it. P. I can get the cannon one. Why is this one inferior? I don't get it. Well,. I think I'm actually going to bring the uh, Canon Corsair. I really like the Corsair a lot. Um, I think that would be a better choice. So, let's, uh, let's go try this bad boy out. Now, I think I've got Rocket Button already done, but um, we'll see how that goes. Nice little map. I really don't have any intention of buying this tank, but I figure uh, as long as I've got a test drive for it, I was going to be playing and making a couple of three furs here at the same time, so I figure this isn't a bad choice to do. Uh, I'll choose that one, I guess. That's the one. Alright. To kick some ass, eh? So we still have the stumpy 75mm gun. Which kind of sucks, because I'd much rather be using the 76. But you know what? When you got these rockets, it doesn't really matter too much. I wish there was some place that we could go, like, super hull down and just launch rockets at the enemy, but... Fortunately, you get what you get, kinda, you know? Kinda of feeling is going down here. And there is a... House. Right over here, that kind of want to go sit at, but looks like they are capturing B, and I'm not sure I'm going to make it there in time. Enemy forces have captured a zone. Which is fine. <coughs> Enemy forces have captured a zone. Allied forces have captured a zone. Right there. Oh, that's the wrong one. Holy cripes. The rockets are like lasers. A lot more of a flat trajectory than I was expecting. There we go. Not seeing anything out there. Back around. Alright, so something right over there. The 
Alright, I know I'm not using the rockets to their full potential. Alright, well, those rockets don't have a whole lot of penetration, how do they? A little disappointing. Are we fighting the Russians and Germans? Okay. I should have checked that earlier. I'm trying to figure out what the hell we're fighting, you know? It's actually kind of fun. Oh, there's a lot of them over there. It serves him right. Yes, a hit. See if he wants to push up anymore. Stuff dying behind us. Hello. Attention to the designated grid zone. Requesting barrage on me. Repeat, requesting barrage on me. So there's some dicker max over here. She's so probably gonna get shot from our right. That's fine. I think we've already had a pretty damn good game here with the uh, Calliope. Definitely, I think we're playing a second one. Alright, let's t fine. Apparently we've got a backup for it, let's take it. Why not? Not entirely sure why I have a backup for the fucking Calliope, but Repairing. Holy Coming. planes. Coming. That was a pretty good game, I'd say.
not really sure how entirely I feel about this thing yet, but I must say it's not bad. Oh my god, this fucking bullshit. Wow. Straight baloney. Teamwork. B34, is that the bolo thing? Got him. I wasted like all my rockets on him though. It's fine. Back off a little bit here. We need to needlessly throw our life away. Oh shit. The target has been destroyed. Capture C. Let's see. Back behind me. What in baloney? his ass. Alright, I guess we'll try and capture this base here. Do something productive, right? I don't get an assist. Oh, is that, uh, hands are four. You know what? I think I can resupply my rockets, can I? Go do that. Or attempt to do that.
Do you think it takes forever to reload each one? Is that is that what that slow one is? Or is it gonna reload all of them? Oh, each. Oh, wow. <laughs> we have two. This game's over. That was not bad at all. A wingman, apparently. Work. I think we'll play one more, uh, just to ensure that this thing is not not uh, false advertising to me. And this is by no way promoting you to buy the Calliope. This thing is. What fucking? <laughs> it's more expensive than most of the, the tier four premiums. If you're gonna buy a premium of that price, buy the T29. Buy, buy literally any other tier four, tier three, or li literally any other thing you could buy for that price. I think you can get a good amount of premium for that. Yeah, you can also get a year of premium for that price. It's not worth it. Just to let you know. Um, this test drive is probably going to be the last time I play this tank for a good long time. Alright, here we go. Oh. This ought to be interesting. Huh. Almost inclined to go up the middle here. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. Start over here. I'm not sure how this is gonna go. The whole long range sniping with this thing is uh and we're up tiered fully. Oh good. So I'm gonna be fighting T thirty four eighty fives, which will be super duper fun. Yay! After thinking about it uh, for a little bit, I, I'm still not sure how I feel about this tank. Um, on one hand, it's done pretty well. On the other hand, we'll st I think that this is going to be really the deciding factor of this game. If it can do well at medium to long range, uh, I think it will be an alright tank in my opinion. Uh, but if it's really only a close range brawler like we saw in the last battle, I think it's severely hampered by a lot of the maps in this game. I want to know what that shield is from, because I feel like I have seen it before, but everyone seems to have it, and I don't think I do. I don't remember, and I don't know what that's from, but uh, anyways, um, yeah, I don't know, I, uh, I'm hoping this thing does well, but Big question mark right now. Right meow. There's a jumbo. Oh shit, I thought that Centurion was alive. Oh, I was like, oh no. But no, it was. It was not alive, thankfully. I like how sketchily jury rigged this thing looks. Cut off, it's okay. Probably fire over rocks with the rockets. The other thing is that there's no stealth with this tank. This thing is like anti-stealth. Fighting Germans and Russians, okay. Oh, Attention to the map! 
Yeah, the 30 cals don't make very much of a smoke. I almost want to go inwards rather than outwards. That didn't go very well. It's kind of hard to... My rocket button for planes is uh, the same button as my binoculars. Because it's on my mouse. Um, keep on hitting that instead of the... the rockets. Where is everyone? Couldn't have all died that fast. Oh no. The target has been destroyed. Got his ass. Attention to the map! Well, that was exceedingly boring. So we'll make our way over here to B. Alright, well, good work everyone. Tried your best. I uh, got a kill. That's all that matters. Die free. Thank you very much. Ballsy. I like it. Relentless against that M18. All right, well, it's kind of. Let's keep the pressure on. Victory is close. 
unfortunate, but that's the way she goes, boys. SPA guns apparently, that's the only thing we're allowed to fight. Still burning hot. Oh yeah, it is. Cool. Well done. That's a ten. Cover it up. All right. Well, that was the Calliope. Uh, after playing a whole two battles in it and getting what, like. 10 or 11 kills between the two um, I think my first dish impressions are uh, good but it's not as good as it is for what it's worth I mean it's almost 10,000 gold if you're looking to buy a tank uh, it's a premium tank I would much rather buy the M18 black cat uh, the T29. I, I enjoy the M46 Tiger in uh, realistic and simulator battles, but, uh, well, not really simulator. It doesn't have a good simulator battle, to be honest, but uh, realistic battles is pretty good. Um, I've heard good things about the Super Hellcat. Uh, surprisingly, the Cobra King has its moments. Um, now that's dropped down a, t a battle rating, and it, it, it has its moments. Um, T20 is actually not that bad. M3 Stewart's fantastic, but uh, if you're looking for tanks in the Americans or really anywhere else, if you're looking for a money grinder, I would highly suggest going somewhere else. Um, the amount of money that you'd be able to buy with this is what, like 5 million ish, give or take a little bit. Um, if you're gonna play this tank enough to make five million credits you're gonna have to play it a lot and to be honest I would much rather actually play the M18 Hellcat I think that that is I fairly certain it's cheaper um, well I know it's cheaper because the Calliope is one of the most expensive premium tanks um, but I know it's cheaper but it's also a lot easier to play I find the Hellcat to be very fun and realistic and simulator um, so if you're looking for a premium tank, this is not the one to look for, but if you're looking and you've got money to burn and you're fucking rich as hell and you're not like me and you don't like to throw money at a lot of things as opposed to just one thing, um, this one's not bad. Uh, rockets seem to be a little hard to aim. I was having some troubles there. And they're hard to judge distance because you can't see where they land because of all the smoke. But overall... I'd give this thing like a six and a half out of ten. If it was more fairly priced and maybe like five thousand gold or so, I'd definitely put it up in like the eights, eights or so. Um, five thousand gold puts it. I'm not even sure where five thousand gold sits to be honest. Yeah, I think five thousand gold is pretty fair. I mean, the KV2 is three thousand. Um, I think five thousand gold would be pretty fair. So, yeah, I don't know. Um, just kind of my impressions of it uh, make sure to like comment subscribe and uh, wish you all luck here in the future with whatever you're doing um, see ya